I am making my way into Michael's right now because I wanted to film some TikToks today, but I need some colored shirts. So I'm gonna come in here. I know Hobby Lobby has them. Oh my goodness, it's really busy in here today. So they have the, one of the red ones that I need. It's huge. I also needed a tie-dye one or I need to make a tie-dye one. And then these are kids shirts. They don't have an orange one. They don't even have um, like white, just plain white t-shirts to create my own. So this might be all we're getting today. So I successfully got everything that I'm gonna need, or mostly everything. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's lay down our shirt. I have not tie-dyed a shirt in years, but we're gonna start with the doctor. So I found a small, this is an adult. I don't know if this is a man size shirt, but they all seem enormous, even the small. I could not find. They're really universal. Somehow. Oh, that could be true, because it was just on one side, it was like the adult size. And then on right. the other side, it was baby and toddler. Right. So I almost debating on getting a large youth, but I didn't want to get home and it not fit a little bit. But I'm also portraying men anyway, so I feel like baggier shirts are better. Exactly. So with green, yellow, and red, um, you can mix the colors and make your own as well. So Kenny, his shirt is like, it's purple. It's a big pot leaf. Well, that's Brian's <laughs> Oh, it's Brian. That's Brian. Oh, okay. Kenny has the orange one. Oh, he's screwing. I'm screwing up. Okay, so <laughs> Brian has the big pot leaf tie-dye shirt. Now, the base of his shirt was like purple. It was yellow and then some reds and like orange, I think. Um, whereas the pot leaf was like, I think, a blue or green kind of uh, look. So that's what we're going to try to create today. We got to prepare the fabric, shake well before use. Trust me, he did not allow me to put the shirt on a dirty table <laughs> we're good <laughs> pair the work areas so we have plastic gloves rubber bands and remove the seal from the bottle cap so now i'm recording with josh's phone because <laughs> mine just ran out of space but is my phone just so old because his yes he, <laughs> like it's not a fish lens but i can see so much more of my background and with you this can phone. expand it <laughs> Okay, so we're going to do some mixing here. So I have, I have two plastic cups. We're going to attempt to make, I want to make an orange and I want to try to make a purple as well. Um, and I also have, I have a little extra bottle similar to these ones. This just came from a little planter DIY thing I did with Miss Ella. Um, so I guess we're going to try the purple first. So we're going to do a couple drops of blue. Oh, it doesn't come off. Okay. A couple drops of blue. I'm gonna make sure. Yeah. It could be helpful. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. yeah that's... So the Swiss Army nails come into. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> People ask me why I keep my nails long. That's it. I don't need a knife. I got exactly. I don't need a man in my life. I have long nails. Wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> no, I do because I have long nails. <laughs> and I can't. And they can't open. <laughs> What's your color? Uh, blue and uh, red. Yeah. So we'll start with a little bit of blue. I don't want to go crazy because I don't want to waste too. What the heck? Am I just... This is made for kids, by the way, and I can't manage when in doubt. Now what are we feeling? <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you know what I'm going to do? Just pour a little bit. Yeah. I don't understand why I'm struggling with this, but I am. Mm -hmm. And a little bit of red. I'm just gonna add a tiny. You know what? I'm gonna keep the cap on for just a second to try to get the right color. Did you take the film off? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I'm just. Pour I it swear, just yeah, pour they're it. open. You're gonna want a little bit of a substance to it. 
Okay, let's, ooh, all right. So already turning color, hold on. And I don't think I need too much because I think most of the purple on his shirt was like just up by his shoulders. I'm not trying to make it exact, but you know, those little details. Mm -hmm. This is definitely still just blue. Oh yeah, okay, that's a nice purpley color. I don't know how well, oh yeah, you can see that. Okay, perfect. So we have a little bit of purple and then I want to make just a lighter orange. So we're going to take a red. Should I, you know what, I think I did this wrong. I'm going to, I want mostly yellow. Well, you can add to it, babe. We'll start with the, with the little red that I left in here. We'll add some yellow and then just go from there. Pretty orange. Okay. I might add a little more yellow just to really lighten it up so we have a big difference between the red and the uh, orange. Okay. Good. So we have, again, blue, red, yellow. Now we have our orange and our purple as well. Um, so I guess uh, we'll start with our lighter color in here. So we'll do the orange in here. And then I only have one of these, so we'll have to do the purple after. Uh, but keeping in mind, I want to keep the purple mostly up in the shoulders. Alrighty, now that all our dyes are mixed, our seals are broken, <laughs> now's when the fun starts. I'm thinking, let me make the outline of the pot leaf. Alright, I'm going to let Josh take over real quick. He's going to draw out the pot leaf. Right. And then, I, I get, it's been a long time since I rubber band, uh, or tie dyed, but I think it's literally just putting a whole bunch of rubber bands on your shirt. But as he's doing that, I'm going to read the instructions. So real quick, while he's getting prepared with the supplies he needs, I just took a screenshot so you guys have an idea of what I'm doing. So this is a scene that I'm recreating. So this was Brian. This was Kenny. Yeah. <laughs> and then Scarface is not in this scene, but th that, oops, that tie dye shirt that Kenny's wearing very blurry, but again, purple around the sleeves. So Josh gave me the idea of just, instead of using like the rubber bands, we're just gonna use sponge brushes and dab the color where we want it. Well, he continues to draw real quick. I'm gonna explain something. So somehow within 30 seconds ago and now I forgot that I just purchased this product so I didn't have to even make orange dye. So I'm gonna <laughs> use the spray on the shirt and actually use the dye that we just made, dilute it with some water and hopefully be able to dye that other white shirt as orange as possible. So that's the, that's the plan. Right, so there's your basic outline. Now it's <laughs> now it's about getting creative. You guys can't really see it too much. Maybe if I am I no. You guys will see it come through, but there's a light outline. He did it in blue because again the, the center part. It's like a light blue aura basically mm -hmm. and then just a dark blue outline of the leaf. Um and we're using I'm using these candlesticks to kind of weigh down the shirt and keep it in place. We're making one more color. <laughs> I just need a little bit of a lighter blue. So I'm just taking a new plastic cup. Whoop, that's too much. But I'm just gonna add a couple drops of water. Way more than a couple. All right, I'm gonna do a little practice on the paper towel. I'm just trying to figure out kind of where to start. I think I'm gonna start with the lighter of the blues and start just dabbing along the outline of the leaf. There was a kid in my art class, actually. Mm -hmm. I don't remember who it was. If you're watching my video, yeah. I still remember this. Uh, but there was a kid who made a Yoshi, but it was a bong. And my art teacher oh, never knew. Right, because like, it, it would look like Yoshi. Yes, it was right. so cool, though. He mm -hmm. made it at clay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? There's, there's always those kids in, in the ceramics <laughs> class yeah. that... Either make a... It makes a bong or something, right? <laughs> yeah. Like, no, it's a vase from my grandmother. Yeah. Yeah. Why does it have a car? <laughs> so I'm going to start kind of fading out the blue a little bit. It looks like it, it turns into even a little bit of a green, but I'm not going to be able to get it precisely. But 
what I'm just going to do is just start dabbing out this color. And again, keeping in mind that the lines that I just created, I'm going to be going over with just the blue dye. I'm in the wrong business. I should be tie dyeing. Yeah. Look at this! <laughs> yeah. This is good. This is good. Every little thing is gonna be alright. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> and if you want to, ah. you can even add if you are careful. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> if you just like in the middle, just come straight down and straight down here, just like right in the middle, it'll, it'll be a separation of the leaf. You know what I'm saying? Just a little bit. Right now, yeah, just a little here and there. There you go, straight now. Worry about a thing. You know what? That, anytime I hear that Bob Marley song, no. the only thing I think of is I Am Legend. Oh, well, with with Will, Smith. Uh, yeah. Will Ferrell. Will <laughs> yeah, yeah. Ferrell. Little off there. <laughs> yeah, I always think that movie made me cry so much with the dog. The dog. Oh, I can't watch that Is scene. I cannot yeah, watch. Yeah, I can't do it. Mm -hmm. It's so sad. Mm -hmm. All right. Never mind the kids and the people. But just the yeah, no, people. fuck the people. No, right. just... <laughs> <laughs> I'm kidding. Yeah, I'm but... so all right, so I'm not even adding any more blue to the sponge. I'm just kind of using what's left over, but I'm just trying to start making it gradient. Gra I'm trying to make a gradient from the middle starting to disperse outwards. And Josh had the good idea to start with the blue. That way I know exactly how much space I'm leaving myself for the other colors and I don't run out of room. Now the yellow again kind of goes around the leaf perimeter, but again, um, the blue is there first. So we're going to start. Okay, this is a little, this is a little green. <laughs> okay, this is lime green. <laughs> what happened to my yellow? You didn't leave enough white. <laughs> well, I started, well, uh, kind of right on top of the blue, so I'm oh, not okay. surprised, but I need right. to make another layer. I think I just right. got to let it dry right. for a second. And honestly, that's not really a bad idea because it is green. So. Right. All right. And this one outlines. Yeah, so yeah, too. do that and then go right to yellow. Right? I'm just going to have to go back and forth between blue and green, you know? Well, what you can do is continue with that green outline and then switch a new brush and just go all yellow. Why? You might need assistance <laughs> to help out. With that. <laughs> Why does this happen to me? Oh, it looks like I'm. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you know why, babe? Yeah. This is because I'm killing it. <laughs> oh no! Oh no! I owe you a sweatshirt. No, I'm so sorry. It, it no, might, I'm gonna buy that. Come out, I'm gonna. Oh, no, oh. that's red dye, baby. No, that's not it? coming out. Uh, I'm gonna buy you a new one. Uh, I swear to uh, God. Don't worry, we'll figure it. It's not the end of the world. No. Oh, no. I might have to tie dye this sweatshirt. sweatshirt. <laughs> no, I, I'm so sorry. Oh no, I ruined his sweatshirt.
<laughs> it looks so good. It was a disaster to get here. And the colors are fading a little bit, so I'm just going back over them. But, uh, oh my god, it looks pretty spot on. I'm actually really proud of how this came out. Am I gonna dye the back? No! But the front looks... <laughs> The front looks great and I'm really happy. So I'm going to pick up this mess and I will show you guys once it's all dry what it looks like. Hunter, what are you doing, buddy? We just bought this wagon and I took him on a um, walk outside and he loves pushing like the baby strollers that Ella had and like the carriages and stuff. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to bring it inside and you can play with it for a few minutes. Hi, handsome. I'm just going to put something on the TV just for background noise as well. But it's actually, oopsie. Oh, the poor baby. He bumped his lip. You're okay, honey. Crisis averted. All right, let me get something on the TV real quick. And then it, like I was saying, it is the next day since I've dyed that shirt. I forgot to dye the orange one though, so I still have to do that real quick. So I'm gonna set him up with this. Sweetheart, it's not gonna fit in here, baby. It's not, hi, arrow. It's not gonna fit in here. Okay, you, okay. <laughs> um, We're just gonna put on really anything right now. Um, so we're gonna put on Clifford for now. Ella is spending the night at my mom's today. How am I gonna? Buddy, I can't get through. I can't get through. Ah, ouch, my toe, ow. I hope this doesn't turn into a complete disaster. I left my tripod upstairs though, so bear with me. But we're gonna try dyeing this shirt orange. I lost the gloves that came with the kit, so I'm improvising. Sweet pea, it's not gonna fit next to the couch. Now you just wish for thinking. Um, so I have, again, two orange dyes from yesterday. We have the one that I made and then the uh, spray one. I think I'm honestly, I have some warm water here. I might be doing this completely wrong. Uh, oh, so we're just gonna, I guess, I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, let's mix that around. All right, that's very orangey. And then I'm gonna add this whole project that I don't know what I've been doing, but we've been uh, winging it. If honestly it all fails, what on earth? He's knocking over my trash barrel. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay. All right, added a little bit more, a uh, little bit of that spray one, which just lightened up the color a little bit. So this is what we're looking at. So I guess I'm just gonna try, it was a $3 shirt. If it fails, it fails. I'm going to let the shirt sit here, kind of soak up this water, and then I'm just gonna wring it out really, really well. Uh, and then I'm gonna let it dry in 24 hours. So we have one more day of this project. Hi, baby. He was just helping me tenderize my chicken. We're making some food real quick. I did go to the mall today. I had to get a new phone. <coughs> I'm currently recording, oh my gosh. My nails are so dyed from the uh, tie-dye that we were doing. Anyway, <laughs> um, yeah, I had to get a new phone, so we're finally filming. Hi, buddy, on a new phone. Um, so I'm just going to make dinner real quick, and then I will show you guys the progress of those shirts. Please excuse the current disarray of my household. I'm going to plug ooh, in my ring light. Hello, bra. Oh, and my pants are... Okay, guys, I was home, all right? I don't need to wear belts when I had <laughs> to. No. Oh, my goodness. Anywho, let me rewash my hands. Hi, buddy! Hi, honey! Can't see him. <laughs> Hi! He's fascinated with the... Uh... Hi! You want to see? You're going to be mad at me while I make dinner, but I can give you a cracker. Say hi, buddy. He's, he can't even see you guys. I think he's just getting hungry. I gave him a cracker for now, just to give me a few minutes. Um, but I just have a couple of pieces of chicken here. I think we're gonna do a really simple dinner tonight. Just some parm um, 
and some garlic mashed potatoes and some veggies on the side. We have some breadcrumbs. I'm just using Italian style breadcrumbs. So I have three bowls here. One has the egg, one has the breadcrumbs, and then one is going to have just a little bit of flour. I'm just cooking off the rest of the meat that I had in the, or chicken that I had in the freezer. And then um, I gotta go grocery shopping tomorrow, so I'll get some fresher stuff. So I'm just gonna cook these two off and um, try to use them up uh, before the kids leave on Sunday with their dad. It would have been a lot easier to cut this piece um, to properly coat it all, but do you know me or do you know me? All right, we'll get this going. I, we will have dinner and then I'll be back in a little bit to show you guys those shirts. Also, real quick, I picked this up from Target. I wanna give these a try. So my oven is on as well. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna pop these in. These are the chicken wings, the honey barbecue version. Those magnets are supposed to stay on the dishwasher, silly. All right, give this a light spray. It's only six. He's enjoying dinner at the moment. Uh, the wings are also done. We're gonna give those a quick try. And let me show you the shirts real quick that we've been working on. So the yellow, well, the orange one, but the yellow one did not turn out that great. It's super duper splotchy. Obviously this big white stripe down the middle for some reason, but it doesn't matter. This shirt is gonna be cut in half and it's for a 30 second TikTok anyways. I'm not killing myself, but I am really proud about how this one came out. Did I do the back? No, but I did the front and it does look awesome. Did I do the bottom? No, but this part does look really, really good. Obviously, I wish it wasn't yellow that got in the middle, um, but it turned out really good and I think it looks a lot like the movie scene, so I'm really proud of that. Just so you can see a cute little face. Hi, buddy. <laughs> Figured he'd want to be a part of it too, but I'm going to try these wings real quick. So I kind of, I burned them a little bit to be honest with you, but. Ow. Oh, they're so hot. I think I might have honestly enjoyed making them in the air fryer a little more, but they're really good. Mm. <laughs> Whoa, careful. <laughs> Hi, honey. I got a vacuum. <laughs> Dude, that's okay, go get your spatula. We'll take a break for a second, get your spatula. Yeah? Okay. <gasps> <laughs> No kisses. Come on. You're not getting my phone. No. All right, we're gonna go up and go take a. Ooh. We're gonna go up and take a bath. Oh, cause I'm with cranky. You're not getting it. That out. I'm getting ready to crash tonight, but I forgot I wanted to show you guys one more thing I got at the store. And there are these limited edition, yes, I got them on clearance. <laughs> um, what were they? Uh, strawberry ice cream cone Hershey Kisses. They were pink, to be honest. That's what made me buy them. Oh, they're, oh. Oh, wow. Particular smell. There's the packaging. Oh, they are actually pink. The little light pink Hershey Kisses is so cute. It looks like they have like strawberry bits in them. Um, I'm not crazy. I'm not crazy about it, but. It's also not terrible. I'm gonna see if Ella likes these. If not, these will just sit in a candy dish and look cute. 